the way an art lover looks at a beautiful painting and gets emotionally involved, this is how car lovers look at beautiful cars. There's like some emotional response going on. Cars are for all the senses. You know, you can see them, you can hear them, you can touch them, you can feel, you can smell the mixture of leather and oil inside. You can smell the history of a car. A race car smells different than a luxury car. What defines our being here in this three-dimensional world, of course, is gravity. And, you know, nothing brings this experience of gravity better to you than cars where you experience all the G-forces. Those are great sensations. Those are the quintessential sensations which, you know, make up our existence here on this planet, on this Earth. And with cars you can experience them. And they are living spaces, except you can take the living spaces with you. Um, if you are an art lover, that's great. You can like, get an emotional response from a painting, but you can't travel around with it. I remember when I saw my first Mirage and I heard the deep exhaust noise approaching first. And I turned around and I saw the car. And what I like the Mirage particularly is this incredible understatement. So you don't drive around with an image. You don't drive around with a Porsche Turbo with a huge whale tail or with a red Ferrari. You're driving a car, but the car has presence. And when I saw that, you know, for the first time in Berlin, that was what amazed me. You know, the car sounded great. It had a huge presence on the road. It was a big car, but it was so understated. In Every single screw has been touched by a craftsman. Every single you know, piece of aluminum has been beaten into shape by hands, hand formed, hand welded, polished, hand sewn, stitched leather. That also gives you a different feeling. There is a different vibe coming from the car. With Aston Martins, you know, there's like so much love and dedication and craftsmanship and passion went into building the cars by all the craftsmen who came together to work them, that somehow their consciousness, I don't know, got into the car, and when you're close to the car, you can feel it. Leonardo da Vinci once said, science and art can walk hand in hand. Nothing personifies this idea more than the existence of beautiful collector cars or race cars. If you look at spiritual traditions, you know, the idea is to get your mind into the here and now, into the present, being in the moment. And a car will do that no matter what. You'll be engaged, you'll be in the here and now, you'll be part of the experience of the car.